It's the first GIGU lab, and I'm teaching you how to percuss. So percussion, as you know from the lecture portion of the class, is very simple. You put down your hand, you leave your fingers apart. Let's say this is the patient's abdomen right here. Their head would be up here. Their feet would be down here. Uh, they're supine, looking face up. Let's say I'm on their abdomen. Um, so to recuss, you're going to sink your fingers down into the skin. The louder you want the percussion note to be, the further and the stronger you push down. Then you're specifically going to take the tip of your middle finger, the pad of your finger, is going to be percussing down like that like a woodpecker kind of, peck, peck, peck. It's going to be hitting the middle finger distal interphalangeal joint right there on the dorsum of the hand, right? So it's going to look like this. And you're going to have some rhythm to this, right? You just don't go like that. You're going to go one, two, move, one, two, move, one, two, move. One, two, move. Got it? That's all there is to it. I can do it this way. I don't know if I can see it better. One, two, move. 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 If you're really uncoordinated, they don't want you to do this, but if you're really having trouble, you can cross your fingers like this and then you can hit like this they still want you hitting the the dip here one two one two one two that's how you percuss remember this is called the plexer plexer it's the plexometer plexometer plexer if you're right-handed, the plexer hits the plexometer or plexometer. This is the one that makes the sound. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Not like this. Not like this. See, I'm moving my whole arm. That's not how you do it. Not like this. Slap, 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 slap. Penalty points off if I see you slapping. That's terrible. It's pecking like a woodpecker. Peck, peck. Slap, slap, no. It's it's in the wrist, the wrist action. Right? Like shooting a basketball. Peck, 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 peck. One, two, one, two. They don't want you to keep your fingers together anymore. That's how I used to teach it because I didn't want you hitting the patient. But I guess that deadens the percussion note. So they want you to spread your fingers and do it like that. Okay? So normally, if we're back in class for real, you wouldn't get out of the room until you could do this correctly. So practice this. Spend a little time. Send me a video if you want so I can see if you're doing it right. And I mean, I can make this up real quick as we get back. The third week we're coming back to class. Okay, you got it? Are we good? Okay, that's the end of today's lab.